What is going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Eleanor. Last time we visited the Golden Butterfly. A little bit tricky, but this time we're gonna handle a silk stocking murder. If my microphone would stop rotating on my face, it'd be amazing. We're at a diner first thing. That's a little oh, bizarre. Folks. I was just discussing with Finbar here how well you were doing. Have a seat. Yeah, my real name. And you can just forget all about it. You boys have a new case. A poor Hispanic woman murdered near City Hall and left lying naked in an alleyway. Another naked woman, sir? Yes. We seem to have had quite a run of them since the Dahlia Queen first struck. Phelps is politely trying to hint that he thinks the Mendez case is hokey. Well, young Phelps, you win some and you lose some in police work. You're happy with the Mueller case, sir? Over the moon, boys! The DA couldn't be more pleased with the evidence, the witness, and the lack of an alibi. Now, get out there and catch me another snack. Let's do it. I mean, the game was the pedophile, not the husband, which kind of makes more sense. He had the bloody thing in the back. You're behind Yay. the wheel. I don't have to drive. I don't like driving. You have the address? It's the alley off of Riso between Los Angeles and Alameda. You're kidding. The next one will be opposite Central Station. Count yourself lucky, Phelps. Most guys would kill to land a case so close to their desk. Yeah. It means they can pop in to hit the office supply of hooch whenever they need it. You know, that ain't a bad idea. Uh, that is not a bad idea at all, Phelps. It wasn't the point, except it was the point. Oh well. Oh, by the way, this is another nudity one because they're always naked women. I don't know if you Detectives, that or not. they're ready to start the show. I'll take you through. Christ's sake. Brothers, Pinker. The cause of death is pretty apparent. We thought we'd best wait for you when you're ready. The lacerations on the neck would indicate a great deal of force. Only 21 years old. Why the library card? Did he want us to find it? I mean, the body's all over the place. The blood's all over the body here. Oh. Another wedding ring torn from the finger. No skin under the fingernails. Hmm. Kiss the blood, BD. The evidence in the Mueller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendez. The best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copycat. Strangled, battered, naked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know the M.O. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out. I've spoken to Brown. He still believes the Dahlia perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. Mueller had no message. Look, Phelps, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on, Mel? Head injuries from contact with road, bruising from a small man's shoe, further blunt force trauma to the occipital region at the base of the skull. Could have been fatal, but clear signs of strangulation would seem to rule it out. Lipstick appears to be a similar color to the other cases. I'll see if I can nail down a brand. I mean, that's not... Good in my opinion. Oh, it's a thorn bag. What is a sock? If she took a blow to the head like the others, she was probably unconscious when strangled.
We'll need to check that. Well, that's not that important. Well. Uh, let's just put down the next marker. May as well follow the trail. Same as a library card. Okay, that gives me something. Uh, let me make sure we have everything. I have a feeling that's gonna be. That I don't know if offhand we have everything we need. Blood goes all the way over here and over here. We kept the area pristine for you boys. Let's check it out. Dang, that goes far. That's got to be a code or a cipher. I'm missing quite a few things here. I'm a bit confused by it too. Alright. Man. thing to do with it. Well, hold on. That's a trash can. I know. Uh, stiletto? No, I don't. That's gonna be nothing, but the shoe I'm more interested in. Proximity to the scene plus the bloodstains. No way is this coincidence. Blood, though. Wait, that wasn't shiny a second ago, was it? Five. House keys strung up like bait on a hook. Think he's trying to lead us somewhere? Probably all the way to City Hall that boy is just kind of a bitch. There's blood over here too. What the heck? Where are you taking us? Alright. I believe we have all the clues now. Empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? He clearly wants us to find these things. He left them for us. There you go, Phelps. You got a new MO. But I told you it was like that. Or he might just be getting more confident. An 
enameled and gold-plated. This was precious to her. But even more blood. Looks like we're going up. Holy cow. Pulled from the finger and hung up here. Wait, What's that's the, the significance? Ring. Wait, there's even more blood? Wait, is this just paint? Looks as though the killer was decorating with this. Wait. Yeah, he's trolling us. Like, he thinks he's gonna get caught. Son of a bitch wants her identified. What? Mrs. Antonia Maldonado, 712 North Hill Street, downtown. You know, you didn't take the other part with you. I don't know how you memorized that. Okay, hold on. I want to check one thing. I want to make sure I have all the clues. There should be nine. Wait. There should be eight. I'm missing two. Wait, no. I can't count. Hold on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm missing one still. Wait. No, I'm not. I'm not. Okay. Oh my god, I have it. one clue twice. Can you drive to this one? Please. Fine. Dang, that's a Where are we slow headed? start though. It was Mrs. Maldonado, right? That's affirmative. All right, so then there's a husband we should be yep. looking for. Get him. We've closed the case. Ah, uh, Rusty's razor, of course. I don't want to question your tried and tested techniques, Detective Galloway, but doesn't the DA require sound casework before he'll close the book? Not if he's got a confession. And, you know, there's ways of getting it. I'm sure. I mean, he, he, he's got a lot of points. I hate saying it, but there's a lot of points where it makes sense it's the husband. 35 cents for a night? That ain't bad at all. Wait just a moment! No. I'm sorry. Can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara LaPentia, the owner of this boarding house. Is there a problem? I'm afraid so, ma'am. Do you mind if we come in? Is there somewhere we can discuss this? Of course. Follow me through to the parlor. Wipe your feet as you come in, detectives. It's this way. Well, thanks. You've been the Mrs. Maldonado was found dead this morning. Dead? Oh, no. She can't be. I'm afraid she was murdered, ma'am. We need to take a look at her things. I can't believe it. A person seems so alive, and then they're gone. Antonia's room is upstairs, last door on the left. Thank you. We'll be back shortly. Uh, excuse us a moment. You know, she seems very, um, not freaked out about it. Five minutes away. Whoa, what the? Did you look at that? 
Someone's turned the place over. What we got here? Oh gosh. She had a, she had a court date. Okay, we have an address. For her husband. Okay, so. Smashed window there. explains why the place looks tossed. You know how I feel about windows, Phelps. What the heck is that? So someone broke in using this thing instead of a crowbar. Wonder where it was taken from. It's a really good question. It's probably the husband that it looks like at this point. The charm bracelet wasn't among the crime scene evidence. Hmm. All right, let's go talk to our favorite. I don't know what I'm looking for all of a sudden. We have some questions, ma'am, if you're up to it. Yes, detective. I'll do my best. Alright, possible suspect. Do you have any idea who might have wanted to hurt Mrs. Maldonado? That rat of her husband, Angel. She was serving him divorce papers. If I killed every wife to serve me papers, I'd be a mass murderer. Are you being flippant, young man? Yes. No, ma'am. Oh, yeah, she's... What can you tell us about Angel Maldonado? She married him when she was 17. He was cruel to her, very cruel. She was a good girl. Little on the religious side, but a good girl. Okay. Movements? What time did Antonia go out yesterday? She left around nine. Do you know where she went? No. I I have no idea. Uh... She was a good girl, but she didn't confide in me. Yeah, I doubt that. A nosy old hag like you knows everything about the people who live under her roof. Where did she go? I think she went to a bar. She's been drinking quite a lot lately. This bar have a name? El Dorado Bar. The Latino place on North Los Angeles Street. That's only a couple of blocks from where we found the body. Huh. Okay. You've had a break-in? No. That can't be true. I think you know. You're being economical with the truth, Mrs. Lepenti. What do you have to hide? I have no idea what you are talking about. I mean, we're going to definitely bring up the broken window. There's no way you couldn't hear a broken window. So Antonia lost her keys and used an iron bar to jimmy the back window? I heard a noise in the early hours of the morning. I thought it might be a raccoon at the milk bottles. It'd be very bad for business if this news got out. Um. I have a reputation to protect. Very economical with the truth, indeed. And break down a marriage. Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. That's about all of her jewelry. What about her bracelet? I don't know anything about a bracelet. But the bracelet. In her wedding photo, she's displaying a charm bracelet. That thing? She never wore it. He gave it to her. She always kept it in that wooden jewelry box. Thanks, ma'am. You've been very helpful. Pay a call to that husband of hers. <laughs> Lock him up and throw away the key. We can either front Angel, seeing as the finger's pointing right at him, or we can check out the El Dorado bar. Well, I think the play would be to go to the... You can the, drive. The, uh, well, where exactly house. are we going? A nosy old hag? And I thought I was coming on strong with the ex-wives line. 
Sometimes you have to be firm to get the information you need. God damn it, ain't that the truth? I actually like the way I did it. 